Wait, I have the face mask spacer. Do I breathe through mouth and nose or just mouth? I've been trying to figure this out. So the reason that we give people a face mask spacer is when they is usually either in children or babies and when they can't create a tight seal over the mouthpiece with their mouth. They might have had a stroke, they might have had a Bell's palsy. Um, there could be any number of different reasons why they don't need that and why they need a, a, a face mask. Now, if you have the face mask, you need to make sure there's a nice tight seal around your mouth and around your, around your nose. I would recommend that you breathe in and out just through your mouth. And the reason for that is that your nose has been very intricately designed to trap random particles, dirt, things like that, particularly with nose hairs. And they are much smaller passageways. So in order to be able to deliver as much of that medication into your lungs as possible, if you breathe through your mouth, you're more likely to actually get that medication into your lungs and then breathe out through your mouth as well. That bit is probably a bit less important. But just if you just breathe in and out through your mouth, make your life a little bit easier. And hopefully the medication will work.